everyone wants their career to never reach a point of stagnation. And in lieu of this, one is always on the lookout to upgrade their career to the next level. Hi all, I'm Upasna from Edureka. And today we are going to talk about how to upskill your career in 2019. So without any further ado, let's get straight into the module. So first up, let's talk about data analysis as a profession. So for data analysts, business analysts and data engineer, the next step that comes is to broaden the knowledge of analysis. Even master's graduates looking for a good senior data analytics position can do it by broadening their knowledge of machine learning, communication, and using statistics to build new models that will make their business grow. Taking up a master's degree or going for a professional certification can help you land a job as a senior data analyst or a lead data analyst. You can even apply for a data scientist job, and there is a massive 40 to 50% hike in terms of your salary. Now for a fresher, Everybody, including students and professionals who are interested in working in the analytics industry, are keen to enhance their technical skills with exposure to cutting edge practices. Now, all freshers, including students and professionals who are interested in working in the analytics industry and are keen to enhance their technical skills with exposure to cutting edge practices, this job profile is definitely the best. One needs to have both technical as well as non-technical skills in order to land a job as a data analyst, business analyst, or a marketing research analyst. You can expect a salary of about $60,000 or 4.5 lakhs as a fresher. Companies like Dropbox, Red Hat, LinkedIn, and IBM are presently looking for a data analyst. Next, we have machine learning. Machine learning engineering is the most favorable and the coolest job as per a survey conducted earlier this year. As experienced people who are willing to spread their wings will have a lot of freedom when it comes to machine learning because you get to start from scratch and build upon that. Everyone from data analysts, data scientists, and even mathematicians can learn and use machine learning. A variety of skills, including probability, software design, and statistics are required in this field. Data modeling also plays a very important role, and programming skills are a mandate. There's literally unlimited job profiles to apply for, and the career growth is a massive 75%. The skills required for a fresher would begin with a definitive analysis of designs and providing solutions for the same, followed by simple concepts of statistics and basic mathematics are also prerequisites. There are numerous job profiles that you can apply for, which include roles like data scientists and data analysts. The salary is a whopping $135,000 and it increases with time and experience. All of the big firms like Facebook, Twitter, Google, Apple, and even Netflix are hiring machine learning engineers. On number three, we have cloud computing. Cloud computing has taken the IT industry by storm, thus making it one of the most sought after careers. Whether you are a cloud security engineer, systems engineer, a developer, or a network engineer, cloud computing will always hold as a valid domain to switch into. If you have the experience with networking, web security, services, and APIs, then you may grab roles such as a cloud architect, sysops admin, DevOps engineer, or a cloud engineer with a 40 to 100% hike. Now, cloud computing also offers opportunities for freshers. If you have adequate knowledge of computer networks, security principles, and programming, then you may take up associate roles as cloud security engineer, systems engineer, developers, cloud architects, or as a network engineer. You may expect a 90,000 to 100,000 US dollars as an average salary, which may be higher based on your skill set. To top it off, major companies like Amazon, Google, Microsoft, and many, many more are looking for skilled cloud engineers. Next, we have the Internet of Things. So from smartphones to smart cars, IoT represents millions of dollars of potential for an industry. It's based off of many technologies that experienced professionals are already familiar with. IP experts, both software and hardware engineers, and even UI designers could find themselves in companies ranging from startups to tech giants that are driving the industry. Hence, the skills you require would be embedded systems, network security, cloud computing, edge computing, UI design, and data analytics. A transition from each experience level bracket to a higher one can lead up to about a 50% jump in your salary. 
Now, companies investing in freshers for IoT like Google and IBM have a vested interest. Their core products and services are built around delivering and facilitating IoT. With companies like Verizon, it is more about preparing for the future. They mostly hire front end and back end developers as well as software and industrial engineers. The median salary for IoT professionals is 5.2 lakhs per annum in India and $140,000 in US which is about 76% more than the IT sector. And the skills required are not very different than the ones discussed earlier. As a fresher, you can apply for a solution architect, a UX designer, network engineer, a backend developer, or an embedded engineer. On number five, we have DevOps. Now, professionals such as software developers, sysadmins, and junior DevOps engineers can go for DevOps expert roles. The skills needed include a good knowledge about source code management systems, continuous integration and continuous delivery tools, containerization tools like Docker, and an expertise in automation tools. In-depth knowledge of DevOps tools is also appreciated. Also, various configuration management and deployment tools are also a must. Once you've gained these skills, you can apply for job roles like a release manager, automation expert, and a senior DevOps engineer. But this is about experienced professionals. What about freshers? Now, every organization is using DevOps practices. But what are companies looking for in a DevOps engineer? If you aspire to become a DevOps engineer as a fresher, at least one scripting language like Python or Ruby is required. Source control systems and continuous integration tools like Jenkins, infrastructure automation tools like Puppet, containerization tools like Docker, technologies like OpenStack, AWS are also a plus point. OpenStack and AWS are also a plus point. Job profiles you can apply for include security engineer, quality assurance, and integration specialist. A fresher earns up to $90,000, and companies like PayPal and Amazon are eagerly looking to hire DevOps engineers. Next, we have data science. Data science is the future of artificial intelligence, and it is one of the most in-demand careers today. Marketing, finance, healthcare, and media professionals can all try for a career in data science. Even people with an IT background have a good chance of acquiring a data science career. The skills needed include statistics, a master in either R or Python, or preferably both, data processing and exploration, machine learning concepts, and visualization. On acquiring these skills, you can apply for various jobs, including a data scientist, a data analyst, a data architect, and a data engineer. After a few years of experience, your salary will hike up by at least 40%. On number seven, we have automation. Now, automation is set to take the world by storm. But the question is, how will you upgrade your career in this field? Whether you are a product manager, DevOps engineer, enterprise architect, or a quality engineer. If you possess the skills in DevOps and Agile methodology, have the knowledge in SCADA, and have a hands-on experience in RPA tools, then you can switch your career as an automation architect. Then you can switch your career as an automation architect or a lead software developer and get a 25% hike in companies running the industry. Now, automation industry offers opportunities for freshers as well. If you have good programming skills in Java, C++, Ruby, or Python, and have knowledge about automation tools such as Selenium and XUnit, then you can apply for job profiles such as quality assurance engineer, test automation developer, and automation test engineer. In such job profiles, you will get an average salary of $54,000 to $105,000 in companies such as Amazon, Google, Apple, Simmons, and so on. On number eight, we have blockchain. Now, the elephant in the tech room of 2018 is certainly blockchain. Thriving with infinite potential, career growth in this sector is a promising 25%. Aspirants for a career in blockchain include anybody with a development background, regardless of the technology stack. The skills that need to be honed to land a job include basic web development, smart contract development, aside from a good grasp on distributed ledger technologies. If you think you have what it takes, then you could apply for roles such as a blockchain developer, a blockchain engineer, a blockchain consultant, or an application developer. On number nine, we have big data. Now, big data is playing a game-changing role in shaping most of the industry domains. If you are already a Hadoop admin, developer, or a data analyst and wish to upgrade your career, then you need to possess various skills like quantitative analysis, working with unstructured data, command and programming languages. 
Familiarity with big data tools like Hadoop, Spark, Hive and Kafka is also essential. If you master these skills, then your door is open to various job roles like senior Hadoop admin, system architect, senior Hadoop developer with a career growth of 45%. Now, Big Data also offers a wide range of opportunities for freshers. To become a Big Data professional, you need to master Big Data tools such as Hadoop, Spark, and many more. As a fresher, you can apply for various job roles like Hadoop Admin, Hadoop Developer, Architect, Data Analyst, and a Data Engineer. The average salary for a Big Data professional depends upon the profile, but it lies between a lucrative 95,000 to 115,000 per year and companies like Oracle, IBM, Microsoft, and Dell are hiring for these roles. Next, we have web development. Now, web development is a career that gets more rewarding with experience. As you include an array of skills in your resume like Ajax, different frameworks like Angular and React, and preprocessors like SAS, version control, API handling, etc., paychecks get more and more generous and can go up to $140,000 depending on experience and employer while also promising an annual growth of 30 percent now people with some industrial experience in app development and web development who are comfortable with both front-end and back-end services are applicable to the job profiles in this faction this also includes designations like full stack developers lead developers and application architects now web development has been a lucrative career field for a lot of freshers because they have realized that the need for new websites will never die. Freshers can apply for web development related jobs prior to studying basic skills like HTML, CSS, JS, and PHP. But keep in mind, knowing a little more always helps. Freshers can apply for beginner level positions like PHP developers, .NET developers, etc. while expecting a median salary of $60,000 a year from companies such as Velotree, Raze Labs, Netflix, etc. On number 11, we have cybersecurity. If you're already working in the field and seeking career advancement, there are plenty of opportunities with skills like incident response, audit and compliance, intrusion detection, access management, and advanced malware prevention. You can get to advanced level roles like lead security engineer, cybersecurity architect, and many others. Professionals here are offered a hike of nearly 45%, but that's not it. There are many opportunities for freshers to start and advance their careers within cybersecurity. Most employers would want you to have sound coding skills, solid working knowledge of computer operating systems and networking protocols, along with understanding of cybersecurity methodologies. With these skills, you can apply for job roles such as an entry level cybersecurity engineer, cybercrime analyst, security analyst, and many, many more. Top rated companies like Apple, Cisco, and Intel hire freshers with an average salary of about $69,000 per annum. At number 12, we have project management. This is a domain which is not industry specific. People currently serving as technical lead engineers, delivery leads, software designers, or business analysts can apply for project management. Prerequisites to become a project manager includes attributes such as experience and skills like leadership, critical thinking, risk and cost management, and good negotiating abilities. Major companies like Google, Capgemini, Cognizant, and L'Oreal hire project managers from all over the world. In this domain, the salary hike generally ranges between 20 and 30%. And finally, we have artificial intelligence, which is one of the most favorable jobs today. An experienced professional who's willing to train machines to make human lives better can do it via artificial intelligence. There's a lot of room to shine and outskill any other similar job. A variety of skills, mainly consisting of programming languages such as C, C++, or Python, are very important. Having a better imagination is a plus as well. There are many job profiles to apply for, and the career growth is a good 70%. With that, I come to the end of my list. At Edureka, we provide various certification courses tailored by industry experts to suit your aspirations taking you through concepts and providing with hands-on experience. So don't wait up. Upskill your resume with Edureka. I hope you have enjoyed listening to this video. Please be kind enough to like it and you can comment any of your doubts and queries and we will reply them at the earliest. Do look out for more videos in our playlist and subscribe to Edureka channel to learn more. Happy learning!